number one is I, I have no qualms about telling anybody about this park, and I am. I'm telling people all about it all the time. And uh, uh, we need to be self-sufficient here in this valley because if you understand the grocery business here, everything is trucked in. And I've been around Teamsters and other people like that, and if they want to strike and don't want to come to Las Vegas, they don't have to, and we're stuck. Three days shelves, uh, shelf supplies in the grocery store if they don't replenish the supplies. So you only have three days to get your food if they don't replenish. So we need to be self-sufficient, and I feel real strong about that. I didn't know about you before. When I found out what your services were regarding gardening and everything, I was very excited. So the only obstacle I had was information, some questions as far as logistics of the garden, but I was uh, pretty well on track with you as soon as I found out of the thing. I think it was a great service, and it's unprecedented in this valley to have this kind of service. I found profuse growth of vegetables, totally organic, things I never thought I could grow here, corn, all beets and spinach. I just didn't think we could grow this kind of stuff, and uh, I'm just really amazed. My kids are eating more vegetables. Uh, it's the freshness of lettuce and things that are just hard to beat and it's, it's just that it's improving our health. I know we've had an, the coldest May on record this May, and I know my tomatoes are ready to burst. As soon as it gets a little warmer, and if you see my tomatoes, they're about as tall as me now. I'm 6'4", and they're looking really good, and uh, no pests if at all. They've just controlled everything with organic uh, sprays and things like that if they need, we need anything, and it's, it's just totally organic. It's just the best way to go.